Hey guys, Escape Wheel Watch Reviews here. My name is Steve, and today we're talking about the new channel. Um, so, uh, in case uh, in case you guys don't know by now, I'm sure everyone that's watching this knows, um, my channel got taken down on the 5th. Um, got the news while I was out celebrating the 6th birthday of my daughter, and uh, yeah, I haven't really had time to dig digest everything. Um, but finally getting my head wrapped around it doesn't look like I'm going to be um, getting my channel back although I am waiting for a little news from Gary over at I Like Watches um, so hopefully that'll be good but um, yeah I'm starting this channel up I'm going to be posting a review video today for the um, the Technical Frog 300 dive watch um, so yeah just keep an eye out for that one and um yeah this will be the place where my reviews are living from now on um so uh that's pretty much all i wanted to say uh, if you want some backstory stick to the end of this video uh, and i'm gonna go through everything so um you know what exactly happened um i got a notice on man what day was it the second i think the second or third uh, that one of my videos had been taken down. Um, and this happened shortly after I shared some evidence with who we now know who is resp responsible for this. Um, and yeah, so I shared some evidence with Gary at I Like Watches. And um, yeah, that same day, like within, within a couple hours or so, I got my first channel strike. And then I got another one. And then my my account was terminated um, so that's that's pretty much what happened um, I've had uh, interactions with this individual in the past um, it all started about about a year ago I think um, he reviewed a Matic Explorer and uh, he was saying it was like hundred and sixty dollars or something like that so I kind of questioned him I was like hey where are you seeing your price I'm seeing hundred and thirty two dollars that that's all I asked and um, he went off the deep end on me. I mean, just just crazy. I wish I had the screenshots from that conversation, but threatening my channel, threatening to go to uh, watch manufacturers and watch resellers and getting me blacklisted, um, that kind of stuff. And um, I, 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 I was kind of blown away because before that, he'd been fine. Um, no issues with him at all. Um, and then that happened, and that's kind of when it started. Uh, he came over to the Reddit, Chinese Watches subreddit, and uh, spamming some of his links and his, uh, his watches that he has his logo on. Um, and, you know, look, five days in a row, I think, is what it was. Uh, he was posting his watch. And, you know, that's one of the rules there. Um, spamming you can't do. So as moderators, it wasn't even me that took his, his uh, post down, but one of the other moderators took his post down. Um, and then he came at me with a just a terrible uh, thread of just 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 horrible. The stuff he was saying is absolutely ridiculous. At one point, he says he hopes I get cancer and die. So that just kind of goes to show you what kind of guy this guy is. Um, so uh, you know, Gary is going after him. Um, I really don't want anyone to go after his channel. Um, or report his channel he's not doing anything that i'm not doing so if he's doing something wrong then i'm doing something wrong and it's um it's not that it's it's just this guy in general just needs to stop and um I, we don't know any other way to do it really so uh i think you know gary is legally going after him uh with the police and with youtube legal um it, he's got a very shady past very shady past and you know hopefully all this information will come out soon um, I just don't know when we should share it or can share it um, so I'm not gonna call out his name I'm not everyone knows who it is by now um, but yeah it, it, it he's not a good guy um, very shady very very shady uh, he does run another YouTube channel uh, I will say that but um, yeah so that's that's pretty much the information on why it happened and you know what to, what exactly is going on and why I'm targeted. Uh, I'm not going to stand for bullying, um, even if that means my channel goes bye-bye. 
you know, uh, I'll start up a new one and uh, I will be more careful because uh, YouTube's appeal process is terrible, absolutely terrible. Um, they just terminated my my account like like that. It was nothing. Um, so, um, yeah, that's pretty much the story of what exactly happened and uh, why I'm being targeted. So, um, you know, I've been asked so many times about what you guys can do to help. Um, I think the only thing that you really can do is get at YouTube on Instagram and on Twitter and uh, write them and tell them, you know, my channel's been terminated wrongfully and hopefully they'll take a, a deeper look at it. Um, but other than that, I, I don't need you to do anything. Um, you know, subscribe to this channel, I guess. Go, I don't know what corner it's in. I'm usually, I'm not used to doing these selfie videos. Um, excuse me. But do... Uh, subscribe to the new channel. This is where all the new reviews will be popping up until my old channel comes back. Um, so, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. If you're curious about some of the other watches I've reviewed in the past, I'm going to leave an Odyssey link down below. Odyssey is uh, another platform for videos. Uh, I, I think it was Honest Watch Reviews that initially told me about this. Um, basically, you can check a box and it'll upload automatically anything I upload to YouTube over to Odyssey. So I do have all of my back catalog over on Odyssey. I'll be leaving that link down below. Uh, but from here on out, it'll be here. Uh, and then also on Odyssey, I'm going to keep on backing up to Odyssey because that's uh, really helping out. <laughs> um, so let me see what else. Um, you know, how am I feeling about all this? Uh, obviously disappointed. Um, I've worked two years on this now about and uh, I just hit 5,000 subscribers. I was doing 5,000 subscriber giveaway. Um, I will re-upload that giveaway uh, and give you guys all a chance to win some watches. Um, but I, I just, the channel's gone, so I can't do anything with it. Um, so I will be doing my 5,000 subscriber giveaway soon. Um, but other than that, uh, I'm just feeling a little overwhelmed. I'm trying to uh, gather information on this individual and uh, help Gary out as much as possible. Uh, but also just overwhelmed by the support uh, you guys have shown me. Uh, it's been pretty incredible. Um, you know, other YouTube channels, just individuals that I've chatted with in the past, people I've never chatted with um, that have, you know, said that they enjoy my videos and uh, they're, they're going to follow me to the new channel. Um, so uh, just a huge thank you goes out to each and every one of you. I, I would like to respond to everybody, but I just physically can't do it. Um, so my phone was going absolutely nuts uh, on the 5th, um, even on the 6th. Uh, it's just been, it's been crazy. Um, I'm just kind of now getting caught up with it so I can respond to people if, you, if you're writing to me. Um, but yeah, I just want to say thank you again to everybody who has reached out and tried to help and support uh, the channel and Gary's channel. I mean, he's going through the same thing. So um, yeah, huge thank you to everybody. Uh, so what's next? Um, uh, right now it's just a sit and wait. Uh, I'm going to start, I'm, I'm going to keep appealing. Um, you know, I am waiting for a call from Gary to, he says he has some good news for me. I don't know what that means. Um, so yeah, we'll see. Um, but yeah, we'll be appealing my old channel. Um, <clears throat> again, uh, the Odyssey link down below. That's, uh, that's where you can find all my old stuff. Uh, as far as new stuff, it's going to be here. Uh, it's going to be the same content. Uh, I'm not planning on changing anything up. Uh, I will be a lot more careful with how I say things. Um, just because, I mean, I don't, the, the terms and services of, terms and services of YouTube state that counterfeit is uh, something that has the brand or the logo of the watch it's pretending to be. Um, and obviously anything I review here doesn't have that. So I don't know what they what they went after. Um, but yeah, I'm just gonna be a little bit more careful, I guess. So uh, for instance, I have a C-Stern 600 dive watch now. I don't have a C-Stern uh, homage uh, of a brand. So. Um, yeah, that's kind of what it's going to be like. This watch will obviously be going live on the channel fairly soon. I got to do the review for that one, but I've got a few other ones that I want to get out real quick too. Um, so yeah, uh, but yeah, again, huge thank you to everybody. Uh, I really do appreciate it. You guys have been great and, uh, yeah, stick around. I will see you in the next one. See ya.